Your mind goes, we take no lectures. I take no lectures from a communist. In the end of the Holy Week, we take no lectures from the have left them. And the loony left over here who won't face the people. Minister, look, this is a shambles. And it's a natural door. And I know your colleague, Mr. Bryan, has engaged with me in many occasions. To think that the people of Ross Gray are today, uh, uh, 10 weeks today, that, that when the hotel was taken over and when the Gardaí was sent down to do it, uh, uh, terrorise the people of Ross Gray. Good, decent people, I repeat, ordinary mothers and fathers, or grandmothers and, grand and, and, parents and children. They had no objection to children. They wanted their hotel. The whole thing was manipulated and supported and cheerleaded by the, by the, by the loony lift, as I call them here. You got your answer in the referendum. The people are sick, so and tired to be. All young people have to go abroad. Uh, for 13,500 13, on our own housing list. And what happened in Mount Street is just a, 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 a disgrace. Minister, you decided to go to Japan. Well, I suppose Timbuktu would be found off at this stage if we went and stayed there. Japan, and saw that happen there. And you know, unfortunately, people then brought them out to the Dublin Mountains and tents and took away the hired machinery to take away their tents here. What kind of Christianity was that? You keep, the problem is you won't stop the numbers coming in. As you sent out tweets to welcome all from, from God knows where. The numbers on, on St. Patrick's Day, all fell apart, our national uh, patron saint, and the numbers. There is record level of asylum seekers in this country on that day and, and, and still going. And the PR stunt then that you had, what you're doing in Brown Street, brought him out there. Minister, will you please down to Ross Gray to meet the people. You haven't gone to Fermi to meet the people. You haven't gone anywhere to meet the people. But you can't hide from the electorate. And neither can Fianna Fáil, Fianna Gael, Sinn Féin, uh, Labour, um, Social Democrats, the whole alley. And you got your answer last week, are waiting in the long grass for you because they are sitting so tardy, because you have a dislike of the Irish people. And you, you seem to have a hatred for the Irish people who elect you in here and who pay your wages, the taxpayers. But, but they're waiting, but you have that, and they're waiting for you.